good morning, world. Say good morning. You said you want to do it with me. Now say good morning. Okay, so now she gets bashful. She doesn't get bashful when she's in the hot in the background. Anyways, um, today's the blogging YouTube YouTube challenge. Say good morning then. <laughs> Typical three-year-old behavior, right? Anyways, today's prompt from the blogging tidbits YouTube challenge was to give one blogging tip for bloggers who just started out. Well, me, me, and me, I can't just give you one tip, but I'm going to give you just a few. First thing is first, start on WordPress with your own domain that you've already bought for the year and make certain you get good hosting. Now, I can't say enough about Mom Web's hosting. Mom Web's hosting is amazing. It's reliable um, online over 99% of the time. There's a very whole month, 30 minutes at max that I was off, and it was only just for maintenance, and it was in the middle of the night. And on top of that, there is awesome, awesome technical support with Mom Web's. Okay, enough of that plug-in, but I can't help but say it every time. Also, make certain you get a theme that is user-friendly meaning your readers can go onto your blog and they can pretty much know where they're going and what they're doing. And it showcases your work to the best of your ability. Next thing would, I would say is choose a niche or niche that you're very, very passionate about and stick with five categories. So for me, it's family entertainment primarily is what you'll see on my blog. Anything from books to movies to video games to activities to do with the kids to marriage things to make your marriage stronger that's primarily what you'll see on my blog but we also do cover other family related topics so my general theme overall is family um the next thing i would highly 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 recommend is getting in with a blogging community or a blog tribe they're both very very beneficial to you and they're both different and they both give you certain things that the other one doesn't. If you're not a part of a good blogging community, guys, that's a very important thing to have. No popular blog, no successful blogger does it on their own. They didn't get there on their own. There's no way in the world that you can be everywhere at once. And that's where the blogging community comes in, is they help market your blogs. They help promote you. They help encourage you. They help you with everything you're doing in relation to your blog. So those are my primary tips when it comes to being a blogger and just starting out. Now I have bookers of other tips that I recommend. There's plenty of other things that I suggest that you do. And that's why I love the Blogging Tibbets group. is because I can give you those suggestions. I can give you that feedback. And I can walk you through it step by step. And give you challenges to help you grow your blog and your social media accounts. And everything else that you're doing online little by little. And we offer challenges every day. We also offer activities every month where we focus on a certain topic every month. So those are all things that you can benefit from with Blogging Tibbets group, not to mention the community and the relationships in which we've built. So that's my tips. If you're a blogger and you've been blogging for a while, or even if you haven't been blogging for a while, what is your number one tip that you would recommend new bloggers have? All right, well, thank you for tuning in, and I hope you look forward to the future Vlogging Tibbets YouTube Challenge videos that are coming. All right, bye-bye.